ဒါပေမဲ့တော့ပြိုတ်တက်များအလုံးမဲ့မင်္ဂလာပေါ့ခင်ဗျာအင်္ဂလိပ်ရနိုင်ငံမွာမင်းသမီတူဖြစ်တ
you know, if I'm feeling like I want to be Audrey Hepburn today, I'll be Audrey Hepburn today. Sure. Angelina Jolie, I'll be Angelina Jolie. Sure. If I want to be like a Priyanka Chopra, I'll be badass. She will be like that. Yes. So <laughs> I think it's it just depends on my mood and also it's something that is unique to me. Yes. I don't have to follow anybody. I'm a very emotional person. Of I'm course. very positive. Of course. I always think that if anything bad also happens, there's always something that good that comes out of it. Oh. So I always tell my friends that. And lots of people make fun of me. They're like, oh my gosh, he's like a saint, like a spiritual guru in oh, India. Yeah. I was like, no, I'm just being me. So yes. that's who I am. You're just you? Absolutely. Yeah. And like, I don't plan things. Yes. If things are happening, like right now, I'm here in Myanmar. I want to focus. I want to learn. I want to do everything that is that, that I can do right now. Yes. Instead of thinking too much into the future. Yes, that's think just about in a way. You yeah. don't have a plan. Yes. No plan. Yes, yeah. yes. So, uh, since you're running on three careers, mm -hmm. you might face some difficulties in the past. So, and how did you manage your time? And oh my God. The way I started was, yeah. I didn't even think I would be a model. Like, I was so insecure growing up. Yes. Like, in school, I was being teased for my hair, for my lips. Like, I was called names. But again, they were kids. And I was a child too. Yes. I was a kid too. So, I think that also gave me, like I, how I said, I see a bad situation, I yeah. turn it into good. Oh. I turned into positive. So it was nothing but a yes. push for me. Yeah. So I tell every girl, if you have a dream, go for it. Don't think about what people think. Follow your heart. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Uh, and I found out that you also in the Dome Tree, right? Yeah. What about your Dome Tree experience? Let's share with your audience. Okay, I have to tell you this. I uh, auditioned for Dome Tree when I was in yes. Los Angeles. Yes. So uh, the movie was shot in Chicago. Wow. So they needed somebody who can speak in Hindi yeah. and English. Yes. And it's very difficult to find an actor in America who can who speak, speak both, both the languages. Yes. Uh, so you suited perfectly. Absolutely. Yeah. And they wanted fashion type. They wanted glamour. They didn't want like, you know, very girl next door. Yes, yes. So it was kind of weird, but in a way that's the requirement of the yes. film. It's Bollywood. They wanted yes. like glamour. So I auditioned, I got the part. I was so happy because even though it was a very small role, it was with my favorite actor, Amir Khan. Of course. You know, Aishwari Rai's husband, Abhishek Bachchan, who is also one of the biggest stars. You know, he's the son of Amitabh Bachchan. Yes. And uh, it's, the production is Yashraj Films. And every it's, film of Doom or Buffett exactly, is famous. Yeah, exactly. It's Wahid. Yeah. Exactly. But to work in Yashraj Film was every Indian girl and boy's dream. Oh. It's like a dream. So when I got the part, even though it was small, it was, it was big for me. Yeah. I don't see small or big. For of me, it was, a, it was the climax of the film, which is a very important part. I play the role of a reporter. So, yeah, yes, yes, and yes. reporters are strong people. Of like course. they are like badass. So, <laughs> so I did that, and you know, it, it, I, I felt amazing about it. You know? Yes, it might be. Uh, I, I know you will feel very happy at the moment, right? Very. It's Doom Three. Right? Yeah, Doom Three. Of like, course. You know, uh, and also. The scene that I did in the climax was not even a part of the film. Oh. They gave me the scene on set. Because oh. I had two more scenes before that I did. Of course. It was, it was pretty quick. But when they saw me perform, they said, can you do this? And I saw the lines. I'm like, yeah, sure, I'll do it. Of course. You don't yeah. even think twice, right? <laughs> yeah, I felt like million dollar baby, Hilary Swank, I swear. <laughs> sure, sure, because sure. they were like, it was all, you know, like it was outdoor shoot. So I could see audience, like everybody looking at me. Yeah. So I was like, oh my God, I got to do or die. This is a do or die situation. So I did it. Yes, yeah, so everybody yeah. wanted to be part of the movie. Absolutely. And if you were one of them. Yeah. Yes. Uh, let me know, uh, what's the difference between the Hollywood film industry and Myanmar? Okay. Uh, just your opinion, it's okay. The, um, no, you know, at the end of the day, it's pretty similar. Yeah. Because everybody is coming on set with a story. Yeah. You know, starting from the light person yeah. to the makeup person, it's, it makes me very emotional to sure, talk sure, about sure. this. Even in LA, everybody um, comes from different parts of the states, oh. of the United States. Yes. They also come with a dream. So I feel like in a way, it's, sim it's similar. Even in Mumbai, even in Bollywood, the only thing that um, Hollywood doesn't have is good food. Oh. On set, I love the food in Myanmar. Okay. So every time I'm, I'm on set, the production manager gives me my favorite Myanmar tea. Oh, Myanmar, Myanmar, Myanmar tea. tea. Ah, yeah. I see. And that's not there in Hollywood. You get like black coffee or like very boring tea. Yes, yes. They're yeah. used to it. Yeah, yeah they're used to it. You have to, you have to drink every morning. 
Yeah. Exactly. Have your tea time. And it's yes. kind of boring. Yes, yes, yes. This yes. is interesting. This is tea. Yes, yes. I love interesting. You can buy uh, so many instant. You know, uh, you can buy. Yeah. yeah instant yeah. tea mix. Yes. You can yeah. buy. Yes. I'll definitely powder, buy some. Powder. Powder. Absolutely. Powder. That's course. my thing. Yeah. And, uh, first up is modeling, right? Yes. Modeling. So, um, so let's talk about childhood memories. Uh, I wonder how you look like in your old days. <laughs> no, I, I do have some. Uh, I think it, there might be some on my phone. Yes. But I, I, I was, I was a tomboy. I was a boy. Oh. Like as in, no, I was not a boy. I'm yeah, still yeah, a girl. Yes, yes, yeah, I but I looked like a boy. I, yes. My 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 mother cut my hair short. Oh. I play cricket with the boys, you know, basketball, and I, I never. There was not even a single boy who had a crush on me. Because I was like a boy, what? you know, I would wear my father's t-shirt and go and, you know, play, you know, the so cricket. Nobody thinks that that nobody kind of girl cute. will be kind of attracted like, yeah, like nobody that. Nobody thought. So, yes. till 8th grade, 8th grade, I was like that. Yeah. And then I thought, you know, I liked a boy in my school, in oh. my class, oh. from 4th standard. 4th standard? 4th standard. Oh so, 4th, 5th, it's the same guy. Yes, and yes, yes. I thought, okay, this is the time I have to look pretty. Yeah. So I, I started putting little makeup and then, then I went to a beauty pageant, I won it. Oh. So when you're in a beauty pageant, you automatically think you're a beauty queen. Yes, yes. But he still didn't look at me. Oh. Because he always saw me as the boy. Alright, alright, yeah. I see. Sorry, I'm married to you, Chris, today. Uh, I'm just doing it for your friends. Yes. Oh, well. So uh, if you have anything else to say, talk to the audience. Yeah. Uh, well, I just want to say that uh, thank you for your love and, you know, I... I've been getting so many overwhelming responses and so many, you know, so many messages on Facebook. And when I went to the mall the other day, you guys were recognizing me. They recognized so, me, right? Yeah. yeah. As soon as you arrived, you just yeah. arrived when? I just arrived a week. Yes, just a week. And we haven't even started like doing one fourth of the film. Like we, we oh. just started shooting and this is the response. So thank you so much Cheers. for all the love and I will do my best for this film. So, uh, I'm curious about your family members, your siblings. Tell me about your siblings. I have a huge a family. Atra? Address? No. No? They're not in this field at all. Wow. Well, I'm the second one. So, oh. I have an older sister. I'm the second one. And I have two more younger sisters and two more younger brothers. Oh my god. Yes, I have yes. a big family. Oh. And uh, the sisters, yeah. they want to become models. Yeah. Uh, they're like 15 years old. Oh. And 15, 16. Yeah. And uh, my older sister is married with a child and my brothers, they have no idea what they want to do. But oh. I think they want to be in the industry in some way yeah, or the other. Because they're so young. Right? Yeah, they're very young, yeah, exactly. So, yeah. so I am the only person who yeah. is doing this. Yeah. And uh, my family looks up to me and thinks that, you know, that yes. I'm very strong. But you're only one Balayan like that. Yeah, I'm a lioness. And yes. the thing is, uh, even in Bollywood, it's... Uh, difficult to break into Bollywood yeah. because you have to, most of the actors, they are either some big star's yes. daughter or son, or sons? so it's easier for them. Easier I'm for not them saying, to participate, right? Yeah, yeah, I'm not saying they're not talented. Yes, yeah, Alia Bhatt is an amazing actress. She's the daughter of Mahesh Bhatt yeah. and she is absolutely amazing. Yeah. So there are exceptions. But it's difficult for someone who has no background in the film industry yes. to actually do it. Even as a model, it's so difficult. But I think there is some kind of power, you know, like some... When you work towards something, you know, you're going to get it. Yes. So I think... You have a big desire, right? Yeah, you yeah. You want to do it, right? Absolutely. Yes. So, so, yeah, I mean, this is how my life is and I love it. Of course. Uh, yeah. Let me know what's your ideal at uh, address. Right. I love Shah Rukh Khan because, not only because he's an amazing actor, he's one of the best romantic heroes ever. Also, my favorite film is Dilwale Dulhaniya Le Jayenge. Oh. It's one of the, you have to watch it, you haven't seen. Yes, yes. It's so good. So he, you know, he stars in the film. What I love about him is, he has no background in the film industry. Oh. He packed his bag, he came to Bombay, and he just, he started with television. Sure. And then he did films. Yes. He started with negative character. He was the villain in the film. Yeah. And then he became the hero. But now he but, became number one. Yeah, but yeah. even if when he was the villain, people loved him. Of course. People were like, I'll support the villain. Yeah. You know? So he is someone that I really look up to. And the other person that I love is Aishwarya Rai. I yeah, mean, absolutely Rai. stunning. And as a child, she was my idol. She was someone that I grew up looking up to because she used to be a model. And then she became an actress. So even in my photos, I try to pose like her sometimes, yeah. subconsciously. 
I swear. And I'm like, okay, am I doing it intentionally? No. Yes, you don't do it intentionally. You I pick pairs as you like them in your mind. And in your mind. Yes, their movement, their posture are exactly. always captured in your head. Yeah, yes, so yes. her and the person that I really admire now, who gives me a lot of inspiration, is Priyanka Chopra. Oh. She's killing it in Hollywood. Yes. So she's she's Not only global, Hollywood, she's strong. global, global walk star. She's global. Yeah. Yeah. So somebody like her, I feel like when Indian girls do really well abroad, I support them because yeah. it's like if you are doing it, I can do it. Yes. And then it becomes not just about being Indian; it just being becomes being about a woman. So women are strong nowadays. Of course, I as I yeah. see you, women are strong. Hey. Yes. <laughs> okay. Uh, let me know what's your future steps. What are you gonna do in the future? So, as I said, I don't really look into the future much. Yeah. But uh, my next, I have a couple of projects coming up in India. So, I want to focus on that. As soon as I go back, I have something coming up. So, and then I would definitely continue modeling. Yeah. But uh, uh, I, I want to do very selective stuff. The last campaign I did was a Bobby Brown cosmetic campaign, which is oh. like the best thing for a model, you yeah. know. And um, I want to go back and see because the, it seems the hoardings are out in India. So once I go back, I'll see. Yeah. And yeah, I'll just continue doing what I do, what I love. And whatever comes my way, I think if, it's, if I think it's a good step, I will do it. M may it be Hollywood or Bollywood or yes. Bengali films. You don't do care about you will do everything exactly. if you have a chance, right? Yeah, like if it's a good project, like this project, that I'm doing with Kope. Yeah, it's yeah. absolutely brilliant. Yeah. So that's why I agreed to do it. And Kope is a brilliant director. So, you know, when I got a chance to do, I said, of course, in a heartbeat. Yes, yeah. and I saw people loving you in the social media. Yeah, they, wow, they, they talk is, about you. The thing is, I don't, I don't understand. What they say? So I, I, I just <laughs> look at the emoji. Oh. Emoji is always like the heart emoji yeah, or yeah, smile. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So sometimes ignorance is bliss. Yeah. But in this case, I want to know what they are saying because people are saying it's so positive. Yeah. So yeah. So thank you, um, Chesu Timale. Oh, okay, I'll please say it again. Yeah. Chesu Timale to my all my fans and to everybody here, and uh, thank you for making me a part of this. I'm extremely thankful. Of course, you say it too well. Yeah. Thank oh, you so thank much. Thank you. Thank you so much.